Hello, welcome back to the Boomers Tech Show. I'm Bertrand. We teach boomers how to use tech to make their lives just a little easier. Now, imagine having a remote control for your iPhone that allows you to toggle on and off different settings and to quickly access features. Well, that's exactly what the control center does. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to use that control center to get the maximum benefit from it. So let's get started. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to go to your home screen on your iPad and you want to tap on your settings cog. When you tap on the settings cog, you want to scroll down until you see control center and then tap on it. When you tap on your control center, you want to make sure that some features are activated. Access within apps, which will allow you to access your control center with, within apps. And even when disabled, you can still access your control center from the home screen. So you want to turn that on. And you also want to make sure that show home screen controls is on if you have controls that you want to use from your home. So we're going to go down and we're going to add some controls to the control center. So let's pick a few popular things that you probably will want. For example, to add an alarm, you tap the alarm. To add a calculator, you tap the calculator. And let's go down and let's add a magnifier to help you to magnify things. And we also want to go with text size to increase the text size for your different apps. So now after you have added all of those, in a, in a moment I will show you how they would actually be on your control center as we access the home screen. Now, as we scroll back up, you'll notice that it says included controls. Now these are the controls that will show up. And if you wanted to change the uh, position of them, you just touch and hold your screen and drag it up. And that will change the position. If you want to delete one, you simply tap the, the minus, and then you tap remove, and now you have deleted it. So now let's go and let's see what controls are in our control center. So we'll go back. We'll take our finger and touch the top of the screen and drag it down. When you do that, now you notice that the control center is here. Now these are all of the things that you have in your control center. You have your alarm clock, you have your calculator, and you have your magnifying glass. Now, to, to use these, you simply touch it, and then the application will open up. So, this has been a quick video showing you how to use the control center. Now, you can go and add the different apps to, to the control center that you would want to use on your iPhone. If you found this video helpful, please give me a like, share, and comment. In the comment section, let me know what topics would you like me to discuss, be it Android, iPhones, Samsung tablets, Windows, or iOS or Apple computers. Those are the subjects that we can investigate and learn how to use on this channel. I'm Bertrand. Thanks for watching the Boomers Tech Show, and I'll see you in my next video. Hi, I'm Bertrand Dennis, and I'm the host of the Boomers Tech Show. This is a place where you can learn all about the latest technology in a way that's easy to understand and use. If you are a senior or baby boomer like me, and you're feeling a little overwhelmed by technology, don't worry, you're not alone. But that's where I come in. I'm here to help you learn everything that you need to know about your iPad, iPhone, Samsung devices, watches, and more. 
In my upcoming videos, I will be covering everything from basic setup and navigation to more advanced features like social media, online shopping, and even phone photography. We will be producing videos every week so you can learn something new and eventually you will be teaching your grandkids how to use tech. In order to be able to fully communicate with you, we need 1,000 subscribers. Then YouTube will open those channels allowing us to interact. So I need you to share this channel with your friends to reach that goal. In the near future, I intend on having some live broadcasts and Zoom webinars for a more personal experience with you. So, if you're ready to get up to speed on the latest technology, join me on the Boomers Tech Show. Together, we can make technology work for you. But for now, the first thing I need you to do is to subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification so you never miss a new video. And don't forget to leave me a comment below and let me know what tech topics you'd like me to cover in future videos. Let's build a community of tech savvy baby boomers together. I'm Bertrand Dennis. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Now to get started, you might want to look at one of these videos up there.